SWAT team is used against them in the parking lot. Nothing like the smell of smoking ribs at the tailgate party. Hey, Gwen, I stopped by this voodoo head fool, some shrunken head guy, and set up out there two hexes for ten bucks. Put one on my wife's divorce attorney, and the other on the kid at the coffee shop for not leaving enough room for my cream. Remember, in the NFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The Green Bay attackers battle the New Orleans Zombies. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> it's a beautiful day for NFL football. At least in the booth with the AC, personal servants, and blood shield. Hi, Grim Blitzer here with you, along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. How are you guys doing? I'm doing that little hottie who works the deep fry at the concessions. He said, how, not who, you idiot. Even if you got the answer right. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Second down and more than the QB would like. He runs it for three. Third down and long. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. away. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Hey, man, nobody can touch me with an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Pow. And it's first and ten. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh man, what a throw! That sonic blast. Whoa, oh, that is one big mutant sandwich down there. One guy's definitely toast. That's what you call a club sandwich, Grim.
first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. First down and one. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. That's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and two. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Grim. And this is the first and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down in a mile. Oh, oh, oh. That gets me every time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. Third down and 
The punter is warming up. He is fighting for every... It's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. That's a catch for a ten yard gain. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Quinn, why is it that long mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. Yeah, they're all in politics, apparently. Not much there, maybe a yard. Third and two. He picks up a two. And they'll line up for the punt here. too much to kick like that. They just let that one drop and play it safe and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Oh man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. First and ten. Yeah. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. Second down and long. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Third and two. Defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And it's first and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once again, 
as he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the racing. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. First and ten. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stop all over his opponent. I want to take a beast boost injection too. And, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. <laughs> Dirty trick called by the D, and the offense is pissed. <laughs> oh, for you kids at home, that's how you play mutant football. Hey, wait a minute. What the? Ah, uh, did they? Didn't they just? Uh, am I losing my mind? Or did that play that I saw just not happen? Uh, I gotta stop smoking them on tiny laundry pods. <laughs> <laughs> for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grant. Yeah, bigger than yours. Bam! Gutsy run for the conversion. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grant? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were gonna tell me a story like Here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stomped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. Second down and seven. <laughs> oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300. The QB saved some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime.
brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. And these guys are neck and neck to begin the third quarter. You talking about that two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! You ever get hit in the head with a boat? Ouch! That's gotta hurt. Man, those mutant traps will kill you faster than one of Bricks' farts. Scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And that'll bring up second and one. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down! And it's first and ten. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and a lot. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and, well, good luck. There were any functioning brain cells before that hit. They're gone now. Now these guys need to talk to the ref about those calls. And by talk, I mean stomp them into the ground. Third down in the QB. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. And that is a big gain. You know the defense wants some payback after that. There's no reason to go for it here, but they do anyway. Consider calling a kill the ref play. Just saying. <laughs> and the punter takes a defense, says enough of this BS, and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> First and ten. The defense called a sticky ball dirty trick, and the quarterback is in 
a shitload of... Oh, with a punishing hit, the quarterback goes down. Second down and more than the QB would like. Seven. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. I just may be a commentary, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. You should. And that'll bring up third and one. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. <laughs> they want more points, so they're going for two. No one was going to stop him. That's two points. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Call that about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. My parole officer calls. I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. I hope you covered your ears, Brick. He's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. <laughs> Two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. Yeah, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, nice hit. Six yards. And that'll be second down and four. And he was stuck to him like glue. Third and four. Him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. 
and it's first and ten. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. And it's first and ten. Holy crap! He runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. First and ten. You can't keep a good mutant down. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense couldn't do anything! from priming the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. First down. And it's first and ten. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. 
Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. First and four. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. Second down and five. mistakes here just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake straight through the uprights they're looking for a good return after giving up points let's see how they do yeah let's see if they always suck off that was just a one-time thing Kickers, you never know. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. hit me so hard I went into a dark tunnel thought I saw my grand and they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game oh nice coaching move there Hall of Fame caliber well I mean it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game I won't listen to this blasphemy and he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored nicely done trick the last play is a race how did they do that did they go 88 miles per hour just asking oh great tackle when his brain is unscrambled he'll be thinking about that hit yeah most likely in a and the offense quickly calls their second time out that's how you do it do what the quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense Uh, 
Yeah, man. You see that? That's right. You can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Third down. Yeah, timeouts are kind of like condoms, you know, Brim? You got to use them smart if you want to score. Let's see if they did. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Brim, can I kill him? Oh, and the defender cut off that pass like a suburban mom on the way to speak to the man. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Bam! Oh, man, that's the end of his day. He might want to try hurling those traps next time. First and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Well, the zombies are DOA on their home field. And they look deader than a room full of senior Republican leaders. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Well, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotropism. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.